you all. This, everything you saw in there was, was all of them. All the problems were my fault, all the good stuff was them. It's amazing. Thank you. obviously make it to the 30th. So let's take a moment of silence to remember those who can't be here. So, there have been many people, we thank them, but we're here, we're enjoying it, and I think it's time for a movie. We get to see, yeah, go, 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 run, run, run. Very excited on time. Zach, you the love? Zach Weddington, coming from Philadelphia, thank you. So we're going to have for you a very special treat. Let's see. Does anyone not have a seat yet? Chris. There's, there's a bunch of seats up front. Chris gets to sit in front. Who's cool? Yeah. The better crowd, there you go, front and center, my friend. By the way, I want to call up Chris Collins. He's been amazing. His energy, his passion has helped make this happen. It's, it's been phenomenal. Thank you. And Bart? Bart, you Bart? Where's Bart? Bart spent the entire day in the conference room to make those banners. So, without further uh, words, I'm going to hand this over to Zach, my new good friend, and we're going to get a movie going. All right. Good evening, everybody. Thanks for coming out. Uh, spoiler alert, this is an awesome little documentary about the Amiga computer. Okay? I am so proud of this thing. It is such a joy to watch. I've been working on this thing for years, as you guys probably all know, and I am not sick of watching it. Um, I don't know if I'm crazy, maybe you guys are too, because you're still here talking about the Amiga. There must be a reason. Um, you know, when I first came up with the idea for the movie, I was already thinking about what it would be like to show it to an audience. And now that I'm showing it to an audience, I'm thinking about when I first had the idea. And I was just driving in my car to a Mexican roster, restaurant to get some tacos. Um, I had been to the uh, Vintage Festival uh, East. And it just kind of dawned on me that uh, why don't I make a documentary about the Amiga? Because that would be awesome. <laughs> and um, I don't know if you guys ever had this happen, but I have a lot of ideas, some good, some bad. And every now and again, every now and then, I, I get an idea, and it just seemed like a foregone conclusion. And uh, the moment I had the idea, I knew that the movie would get made, and, and here we are. Um, really got to thank the Kickstarter backers. Um, they're they're they're. Yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh, yes, exactly. And uh, I'm just gonna keep doing this my whole life. I'm gonna I'm gonna make kicks for stuff. Um, because I mean, you know, it, it finally addresses, you know, the problems in the market for things like uh, independent film where you can't really raise funds for things which aren't necessarily like interesting to a lot of people, you know, right at once. But I mean, look 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 this this huge audience for this movie. And uh, Kickstarter is one of the reasons that made it happen. And really, you know, the Amiga community made it happen. Um, we, had a, we had a Facebook page. So many people reached out to me with ideas and help. Um, we found 3D modelers to do the animation. 
I mean, this thing is jam packed with great music. People found me from the community, and they, you know, created a custom soundtrack. We've got this animation. I mean, it's just it, it's mind boggling to me, and uh, I, I'm so thrilled. So let's talk about what you're going to see. This is like a sneak preview cut here. Um, I want to show you know show it to an audience and kind of get the vibe for what you guys think before I put the final copy out there. Uh, we've got a few things to do. Um, Color correction, sound mix, just to get it all kind of smoothed out, and uh, a little bit more rendering on the 3D side. And um, you know the hard work is done, uh, but you know I will be reaching out to you guys again because we'll, we'll need some help getting this movie out there. I want to I want to get it out the biggest way possible because I think it really has quite a large audience. I can see people clicking on this. It's like clickbait. Netflix, no question. It's better than half the documentaries I watch on Netflix. I mean, it's really, it's really fun. It doesn't ever slow down. You know what I mean? <laughs> no bias. No promise. Uh, a couple more things. Yeah, um, you know, I could use some more vintage photos so people using the Amiga back in the day. I'd like to see more of that back in the, in, in the film. So, if anybody has some old images of them, you know, user groups and stuff, you can send that to Amiga Photos at gmail.com if you don't mind, and uh, we'd like to put it in the movie. Um, so, you know, this isn't really a movie about the Amiga. It's about so much more. It's about people, basically. It's about people, their dreams, their passion. It's about love and loss. Probably most importantly, it's about engineers. And um, I've had some people tell me that these are some of the best interviews with engineers that they've ever seen. And I think that could be true. You guys would be the judge of that. But when I watch it back, I, I see people that are you know, speaking from the heart. And that's often hard to capture in, in, in an interview setting. Um, all right, it's been long enough. Let's watch the damn movie. <laughs>